Alright, so just finished looting up these guys, so this is after finishing Ghost Town Gunfight. And, uh, you can see Joe Cobb. They blew his leg off, jeez. You know, I was trying to enslave that dude, I had a collar on him and everything. Anyway, he's got this here note to Eddie, which, uh, we'll take that and see what it says on it. Note to self, it seems like the NC or it seems like the NCR are making a move on the power games. If I would, if I want to help them out, I should probably find the closest NCR officer. If not, then I'm probably best to leave the subject well enough alone. Hey Eddie. So we finally found that Ringo bastard in Good Springs. Oh wait, this is Joe Cop talk. So we finally found that Good Spring bastard in Good Springs. He's hiding his cowardly ass in the gas station. We've tried putting together pressure, putting pressure on Trudy, the local barkeep, to give him up. But she doesn't assume we'll make our move on the town. Why don't you just go take him out if you know Okay. Dumb uncles won't know what hit him. Also, I've noticed a lot of NCR movements near our borders. They seem to be scouting for something, boss. Just letting you know. Cog. So I was going to verbatim read it, but damn close. So it turns out we didn't even need this NCR uh, garrison that's over here. Again, this is another mod I've got set up. Right over here in Old Good Springs. Oh, so they've got uh, soldiers posted up here in the tents. This is what that NCR gear is going to look like. Oh, hello there, Private Molina. What do you need? What do you need? I'll end up recruiting you later. Sergeant Floyd, nothing. I didn't even gave him all names last night. Private Hart. What do you need? What do you need? They all look the same, but you know, hey, <clears throat> I'll give the give the modder credit for just putting it together. Pretty sweet. Private Carlisle. What, what do you need? I like your outfit, bro. Once I get that shoddy. Oh, so another mod I've got installed is an NCR shotgun. Oh, and the salute. So you'll notice NCR people will salute you because, you know, if I'm playing as a member of the NCR, then it makes sense that they would salute. What do you need? What do you need? Alright. Um. Let's see if he's got anything on this tool. We've set up our base here in Good Springs under with current Lieutenant Colonel Carlisle. We're under orders from Major Knight at Mojave Outpost to establish a presence in the area and help fight off power gangers. Well, you didn't do any of that, but really nice, uh, lore friendly ads here. They've even got the orders take a squad consisting of three men, one veteran ranger, establish a presence a, a pris in the Good Springs area, help fight off and powder gangers if necessary. I mean, the NCR, you know. Disarray. A few more troops fresh back from leave in California have come here from the Mojave Outpost. Orders from night are to wait until word from Hayes and Prim before action against, against, against the Powder Gangers. So yeah, a few spelling errors, but really good, awesome, awesome done job. They cleaned out the school, replaced it with NCR guys, left some NCR gear. You know, um, it's good work. It's not like it's a uh, not exactly a boulder, uh, boulder dome type level Hello. mob, but it's really nice. Um, and this might be a different mob, but one of them actually puts a. Uh, yeah, this must be a different one. <coughs> one of these will put a uh, big old tower out here, right on the street, so they'll just be sniping powder gangers all day. All right, so Tomas Santiago is heading out to face the wild way. Make his way over to Prim to share information with the NCR, which which of which I am. So you know, really just reporting for duty more than anything else. Ah, no geckos this time around. Okay. Well, I wonder if uh, that SOB who tries to rope you into saving his girl just to kill you. Is he uh, nice? I'm gonna do a hard save here before I leave Good Springs in case I want to change the character at all. Um, there he is. It's worth it just to kill Barton Thorn, honestly. Hello? Can you help me? Why the long face, bro? You 
Look down. I can see you. Ooh, now we're talking. My girl is trapped by geckos on the ridge. I know you're not gonna pay me, but, Go you know. But she'll die if you don't help. Really? She'll die? Okay, Luke. So we're gonna go deal with some geckos real quick. Doop doo doop doo doo. We'll continue onward as is. Obviously that'd be the last point we could stop and change things up if you wanted to. Just shooting geckos left and right. I don't know why my bats has been funky lately. That's right. Real men don't need bats, right? Honestly, I'm probably wasting ammo on these little buggers, but you know. Ah, you little punk. Back here. Little maggot. Yeah, I'm sorry to have to kill you. But if I don't kill you, then killing Barton Thorn just doesn't mean as much, you know? Looks like there's one more up here. You know, the, the Barton Thorn, this little side quest, it's kind of a nice addition to the game. It adds just to the realistic uh, feel of what a wasteland would be like, you know, where people are shady as all get out. You know, like a guy's willing to send you up to your death and kill you just to get rid of a few geckos and loot you, you know. Like, it's a, it's a harsh world, Mero. All right. Don't step on the trap. Oh, I always like me some Coca Cola. Let's repair that weapon. We're gonna need it here real soon. Once, once old Barton makes his way up here. There you are, little punk ass. Sorry, I tricked you, but Sorry. thanks for clearing out the geckos. Now I can get to that stash up there. After I deal with you. Oh, is that right? So, um, let me just see if I can drop anything, move on with my journey. Yeah, I mean, that's not too useful. <coughs> I'm just gonna run along to Prim. Skirt this side of the map and avoid most uh, most of the problems. A few geckos, you know, no big deal. And uh, they usually leave you alone. Come up here to the radio, whatever, mountain man, low wolf. That's what it is. Jam out to some beats. Main reason to come here is for the wasteland survival guide. Uh, read that and get yourself some extra points.
skirt the mountain here and you'll you'll get uh, you'll trigger guys. This part of the map has always been so interesting to me. Like uh feels like like they wanted to do something more here and didn't end up doing it because like you've got this little pond here and you've got you know lots of rock flower but you even have like uh, steps and stuff you know like uh, I don't know what what that's all about but um anyway that's the that was an interesting little part of the map random and then the, the triggered event with the rad roach and the gecko fight here it's always fun Wink your way over this way and you'll get flagged down by one of these NCR rangers, or NCR troopers rather. Hey, where the hell do you think you're going? Prim is off limits. I can take care of myself. Don't say you were Well, fine. You know, you could have been more helpful. Granted, I could have been a little more friendly, I guess, but, you know. Yeah, it's another one of those nice details about the sprint mod. You got the guy running on. Damn, lots of shooting going on somewhere. But uh, with the sprint mod, your character runs out of breath. It's just a nice little immersive... Addition, just a uh, uh, really respectful part of that mod. Hey, hey Sergeant McGee. I'm Sergeant McGee of the New California. I'm, I'm from, from Hub originally. originally. Alright. Maybe Lieutenant Hayes can help us out on these orders here. I'm Lieutenant Hayes of the New California Republic Army, 5th Battalion, 1st Company. What's your business? The NCI. I know the NCI. Military operations are Yeah, classic. BS, bro. Yeah, hey, I stopped the powers and good springs of the MGI. Okay. Some powder gangers did you wrong, is that it? Get in line. Still, you do look capable enough, and manpower hasn't been easy to come by. Alright, fine by me if you want to put yourself in harm's way. I'll mark the staging area on your map. Talk to Sergeant Lee. Yes, sir. That's nice. You can just jump right into fight the law, you don't have to befriend the powder gangers to kill the powder gangers. In the meantime, we gotta deal with Prim. So one mod that I've got, that I pretty much always play with is, uh, I can't remember what it's called, but it just adds a whole bunch more powder gangers to Prim. Um, like, a borderline absurd amount. But, uh, oh, someone's killing them all. Oh, what the <laughs> that is, like, gunfighting over there is, yeah. Yeah, that's the freaking, uh, she's a gunrunner guard that I had there for another mod. She is just rocking those guys, man. But yeah, as you can see, all the dead bodies of the NCR, or of the prisoners, there's just tons of them. You know, I'll come back here later, uh, when I'm better armed, see if they respawn, see if they're able to kill her or not. Yeah, so quite, quite a horrible person just to leave the abandoned woman there. All right, I'm gonna fast travel real quick to old Good Springs, get myself some better weaponry. See what I can get anyway. As much as it'd be fun to plink powder gangers to death with a little 22, I don't know if that's gonna quite cut it when I'm raiding the prison. Let's take a look what we've got. Not much. <laughs> This. You know, the saddest part of this whole game is that you spend so much time in the menu, man. And you gotta be able to code just to download the right mods to, to get rid of it, which, you know, whatever. It's a ten-year-old game, can't complain. Uh, you know, I thought I had a service rifle. I must have already sold that. Oop, I'm naked. Take care of that. Chat. That yeah. was a hell of a fight. Cha. Let's hope it doesn't fight us. Can do. All right. Let's see what chat has here for us. Whew! I stole that to him for like 500 caps. He's 
more than tripled the price. have 22 ammo yeah. okay why not so I'm gonna switch out so ammo I'm not gonna be using and uh, dynamite that I'm not gonna be using Doing business with you. Was Take it though? Yeah. So about that mod off of him. So like I say, the varmint rifle. <coughs> for how early it is in the game, it's a pretty useful weapon. And the, the rat slayers, you know, the, the special variant of that. But the problem with that gun is that it's just so freaking hard to get to for how low power it is. Like by the time you can deal with all those dang rats up in that cave probably have a better weapon or at least you could mm. yeah, I don't see much else that can be of use to me alright well let's go deal with this I'm gonna confront the gangers down here in Gene skydiving. Again, okay. yeah, this game it's, it's great, but sometimes you gotta run a long way from one place to another. If you fast travel, you run the risk of crashing the game almost any time. Um, you know, again, can't complain in such a game from 2010, but. Uh, the Sprint Mod sure makes things a lot easier in that regard. <coughs> There's also the Driving Cars Mod, which is pretty sweet, but uh, it's one of those where it can get kind of glitchy if you don't have it installed right. Um, but I rather enjoyed that mod. Alright, so this little building here is a great place if you want to snipe out some powder gangers. I don't know if my sights are going to be long enough to much of a difference here. Yeah. That's too bad. I'll just make my way around and pretend like no one's there. Oop, there they are. Yeah, if those guys see me, they're definitely gonna come at me, so. Set my quest marker here. Okay, that's the right spot. So you can just avoid those guys by running through here. Again, another part of the map that's just so interesting, scattered with clutter. You feel like like it uh, like it should have been used for something and it wasn't. But uh, you know, no matter. One of the things that makes this game so fun, just the map itself is so uh, immersive. There's always little corners of the game that you find that you didn't know before. Um, so that's a fun element. Uh, since, you know, since I never dealt with these guys, they must still be over there too. So I wonder what happens. Let me save. Is, was Chavez over there? Chavez and them boys. Oh, looks like they didn't. So I guess they don't show up if you do this route because, uh, I mean, I guess that would make sense. So, we're here. 
Well, just you alone, huh? I'm Sergeant Lee. Lieutenant Hayes radioed ahead to say you were on the way. That's correct. We've got surprise on our side, and that's about it. Once okay. we blow a gap in the fence, we've got to pour on the fire and keep them disorganized. Our goal is to take out their leader, some ass bag named Eddie. Ass bag. Leader that's gone, a... The rest will fold. That's something. That's all the briefing you're going to get. Let's go. Okay, well, fair enough. So it's good to try to. Okay, well. So much for sniping, huh? Ooh, nice shot, man. Didn't expect to hit him right there. Way stronger than the Kim Powder games, which, you know, of course it makes sense. You know, it's easy to, to think in the game that the NCR or, and Legion are both, you know, maybe OP, but considering what they're supposed to be. Follow me. And again, the the slave collar mod that I've got here is called uh, I think it's called Near Death or Nearly Dead. It's a great mod. I use it pretty much every playthrough. Uh, not only not only can you take uh, slaves, they, they're great for like pretty much pack mules. Load them up with stuff and they gotta follow you. Once your reputation is high enough with the NCR, you can turn certain guys in. Although they often do get killed like that one did. But uh, once your uh, <coughs> once your reputation's high enough, you can turn them into the NCR. If they're like fiends or legion or you know, I assume powder gangers hey. as well. You like Anybody there? Seriously, we're gonna interrupt the middle of a raid. Load up on guns, man. What I should be doing is uh, taking out an NCR trooper or two to take her out. Grandpa's always the funnest guy to kill because he's a POS. Hey, 
Sheesh, that's bloody. Eddie's daddy. So there is in here uh, a good book, lying congressional style that'll build your straight your speech. And in here. Yeah, I mean that's all just good good lore. I can't open that. Nice key to brass knuckles, that'll be useful, that'll be useful, that's useful. It's valuable. So once again, I'm gonna That's a big old pile of bodies man, my grenade must have really done some damage. So I'm gonna go ahead and loot and finish things with this